So that's, uh, that's really cool. Let me, you know, you, you walked us through it really quickly. Let me ask you uh, exactly how that would work. Let's say that, that I'm at a newspaper and I'm going to read one of my favorite columns. What could I do there with Anywhere that I couldn't do before? Uh, well, the big thing that At Anywhere does is reduce friction. So you could be reading your favorite columnist and uh, it depends a lot on how sites integrate. So there aren't really strict rules around it. Like most things we build with Twitter, we leave a lot of the innovation up to uh, developers and, and third parties. So there's a lot that can be done with this that we can't even anticipate. But some of the obvious things are you can easily tweet from the column itself if you want if you want to tell people about it. Um, and a big thing is you may just want to follow the columns so they can right. easily put in a, a follow of this without going back to Twitter. So straight from his byline. Straight from the byline. <laughs> and that's a big thing because uh, one of the things we found with Twitter is that uh, discovery is, is, is one of the hardest challenges because there's thousands of topics or people or authors or bands you may want to follow. Right. And it's, it's putting these in context where you're already becoming aware of them or you're reading about them. Like, and Twitter is a very easy way to keep in touch. Right, right, right. Okay, so so, so I can see the, the, the benefits if I'm a user. It helps me contextualize a lot of the information and it slashes my discovery costs. If I'm a site, what, what are the sort of key benefits for me? What is it gonna do? Uh, a couple things, one is uh, just keep you, give you a connection back to users that you didn't necessarily have before mm -hmm. uh, and, and keep them coming back. And we hear from sites all the time that Twitter drives them tons of traffic uh, if people are following them. So it'll, it should re result in more followers right. um, for a site and just, just sending out links. Right. Um, it should also you know, hopefully result in more people uh, who are your fans or who are your audience using Twitter um, talking amongst themselves and talking about your content. So hopefully it becomes just a richer experience. You can also do lots of other things. You can bring in those um, users' uh, tweets into your site, and you can create a whole community, community or sub-community with them. That's really interesting. It, it seems almost like it's a platform to, to let sites really juice up their network and viral effects in a way. Hopefully so. Um, 